Cincinnati's certified most accurate forecast. Well, as promised, it's going to be a quiet night and a quiet weekend weather speaking across the area. But you know what? We've got a warm up on the horizon and we'll talk more about that here in just a moment. Here's a live look at radar tonight. It is on a clean sweep out there. Actually, you can almost see that nearly full moon because we've got a lot of the cloud cover that's pretty thin out there tonight. 56 degrees currently at the airport. We've got ourselves an east wind at this hour. Check temperatures across the area. Now you will see a definitive change from north to south across the area. Just depends on your location farther north of the Ohio River. There's not much in the way of cloud cover out there, so temperatures have been on a steady fall since the sun went down along and south of the Ohio River. Cloud cover a little more dominant, a little more widespread, and as a result, temperatures are not quite as cool. For example, here check out Falmouth at 57 compared to Hamilton, which is 47. Check out Walton 56 versus 49 up there in Oxford, so it just depends on your exact location, but temperatures won't be as chilly as they were last night and on either side of the river, but certainly cooler the farther north you are. 48 now in Hillsborough versus 55 in Maysville, Sparta, and Owenton. All right, high pressures in charge of our weather. This is that weak weather system that's been passing us by to our south, and as promised, I didn't think it would deliver us much in the way of any rainfall, and it looks like it's going to stay that way. Even the cloud cover now beginning to decrease a little bit from north to south. That bodes well for lots of sunshine tomorrow. I do think there will at least be some cloud cover that lingers around overnight tonight, especially along and south of the Ohio River and then through the early part of tomorrow. Here's a look at Futurecast. Very, very quiet on here. Again, other than a few passing clouds, that's really about it. I expect sunshine to become more abundant as we head into the weekend here, especially on Sunday as temperatures climb close to 80 degrees by the time we end the weekend. So the jet stream that's taken a dip across Ohio the past day or so has brought us in that cooler Canadian air. It's on the way out. We'll begin to get in on some of that warmer weather tomorrow, and that will only continue to build Sunday and into Monday and then peaking into Tuesday right now, it seems, in which we very well could flirt with record warmth on Tuesday. We could have temperatures as warm as maybe 85, 86 degrees in a few areas. So if we get that warm, it will certainly be a record right now. I'm forecasting us a degree or two below that. But either way, I don't think anyone will complain about 80s here in mid to late October. 53 for an overnight low, mostly cloudy skies and cool. Again, more clouds south of the river. Tomorrow, partly cloudy and warmer. We'll climb up into the mid 70s. We'll make it up to about 76. Here's your day planner. 54 at 8 a.m., 70 by lunchtime, and then into the middle 70s during the afternoon hours. Here's your seven day forecast, and you can see that mercury just keeps climbing there. Saturday, Sunday, Monday into Tuesday, and then all of a sudden, Mike, we hit a roadblock in the middle of the week. Rain comes in and temperatures begin to fall, and we get a reminder that it is middle to late October. All right, so the way it goes, Kevin.